This is Jordan Tao with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe, and let's get right into the news. All right, so that camera footage was released, and it was just as horrible. The police were on something, and they thought that weren't they were warped into the WWE ring itself. I mean, uh, Tyree Nichols didn't have a chance. These cops were drop kicking him, holding him up, drop kicking him in the face. It was disgusting. Uh, he lost his life. And this goes to show that we have elected officials in government. We have people that are hired as policemen. We have people that do a lot of jobs that we're supposed to be able to trust these people. They're paid with our tax dollars, right? Not just cops. I'm talking about government officials everywhere. There's corruption on every level that needs to be fixed somehow, and it never will be. And I hope, you know, there's nothing that can bring these parents their child back, you know? And that's the sad part. And I mean, it's almost like you gotta operate as if there is corruption everywhere. I, I, I don't even know what to say. There is no solution. I just hope they don't go and burn down their own city. And I hope they don't burn down every city. That's not gonna fix it. Cause it didn't fix it last time, did it? So I don't know what does fix it, you know? I don't have the answers. Maybe you guys do, but it's, ugh. Kind of, you know, just, yeah, it makes you want to cry, man. It's just sad. Joel Santana, um, glad he got a feature with Lil Wayne. I'm glad he's still able to get a feature from Lil Wayne and everything. And he teases this feature. I hope it has the impact he wants it to have. I hope he gets a shot. I hope he really gives music a shot this time. It's been a long time. He got to get one more off at least, you know. Kanye West goes crazy, man. Uh, pulling up to his daughter's game. Some people were following him and filming him. He goes up and throws somebody's camera in the woods. That's another uh, day in court for Kanye. Uh, then we got, okay, so Alan Hughes calls out Master P because Big Tr well, Trell, Trell uh, from DC, right? He did an interview saying that Master P was working on, when Master P called him, said he was working on Menace uh, to Society sequel. But according to one of the film directors, this was never the case. So Master P used that to kind of dupe Fat Trell into flying out to Cali, spending two years out there so he could start a group with them. It was never a thing. Uh, oh yeah, Louis V, mob member Alley Boy. Trell said the movie, in the, and they were all in a group together. I remember that. Troll said he, uh, I had been living there for seven months. I hadn't started an acting class or anything. No scripts. I knew something was up. Yeah. Jeez, Master P's like, it's always up to something. Young Scooter Blast, Nori, Nori. See, this is why you can't have someone on The Breakfast Club doing, uh, that's a guy doing rumor report. Because they're more likely to get called out by people. When Angie was doing it, uh, or Angela, uh, nobody was really going to call her out because, like, I don't know, they just don't. You just don't call Angela out. She does the rumor report, and that's it. And, and if she gets called out, she hands it gracefully. But, you know, of course, Scooter, <laughs> he defends Future, and he says, uh, her Nori got an eggplant. Uh, up his butt Just what I heard Stop hating for news, boy I don't think it's hating They said Future was upset about it Maybe he was I don't know And I, I'm never gonna stop talking about this uh, Unfunk, which is supposed to be Young Thug's half-brother or something Dude, You sold your brother up the river Don't be out there calling saying you're going to hold down YSL until he gets home and stuff like that. It's disgusting. To be honest with you. Just move on with your life. You know, just keep moving forward. You did what you did. It is what it is. I think that's it. Yeah. 
This is Jordan Tao with JT News.